The University of Florida's president spent some time in Palm Beach County today announcing a new collaboration with tech giant IBM. WPTV News Channel 5's Lindy Supal in West Palm Beach with what that means for our area. As more companies lean on artificial intelligence technology to expand, the University of Florida making a bold move to make sure all students are ready. We're the only university in the nation that's doing two things. Florida's flagship university making waves in South Florida. We are embedding artificial intelligence concepts in the curriculum of every one of our colleges. University of Florida's President Kent Fox in West Palm Beach Monday announcing a new partnership with IBM that's connecting all students with curriculum in artificial intelligence. So you won't be able to graduate from the University of Florida without being a part of what we're calling the AI-enabled workforce, no matter whether you're in journalism or whether you're engineering or, or medicine, any area. IBM says 90% of companies now consider AI technology an essential component to their business model, but there's a shortage in the number of workers equipped with the digital tools to meet the demand. IBM's Skills Academy will be offered to students to accelerate the learning process. We don't have the leverage to get four years of waiting or five years to get. We need someone within six months. This announcement comes as University of Florida expands its footprint in Palm Beach County with plans to build a grad school campus in West Palm Beach and the recent UF affiliation with the Scripps Research Institute in Jupiter. Expanding the, the UF presence all over Florida just helps our reputation locally and, and around the world. With more global initiatives positioned in Palm Beach County, AI technology will be a leading component in the programs taking shape. The couple a leading company with the university and other universities in the community is a powerful combination. Dr. Kevin Fox said plans to build a grad school in downtown West Palm Beach are moving at lightning speed. Pending land approval and state investments, we could see students on campus by next fall. Reporting in downtown West Palm Beach, I'm Lenny Supal.